Hello, my name is Victor Jernigan and I'm with the Knoxville Real Estate Investors Association, Knox RIA. And this is the first of what we anticipate to be a long series of questions and answers on real estate investing. Like a lot of investors, I've been hesitant to start the videos because I wanted everything to be right. I wanted the right kind of lighting. I wanted a better camera. I wanted a better banner behind me. I wanted a different set. But the reality is what I really want to do is provide serious information on real estate because that's what Knox Rhea is really about. And today I'm going to be talking about the five essential, absolutely essential attributes that every successful real estate investor needs to have. The, the goal of real estate investing is to do something at which you will have long-term monetary gain. There's, there are lots of additional attributes that come from real estate investing, but that really is what the long-term goal is. And before we really get into a lot of details about the attributes, what I do want to mention is that part of, is part of our disclaimer, which is in full at the end of the video. It's, it says for sure, trust nothing that I say. Take nothing as a statement of fact. Instead, question every statement. Your goal is to prove me wrong in what I say. And the reason for this is not just the legal requirements, which are certainly important, but because when you take the time and make the effort to become a successful real estate investor, you have absolutely the opportunity to improve your life and change your community for the better. In our group, I wind up having new people ask, what does it take to become a real estate investor? And people who have had four or five transactions come up and they say, I'm not sure I'm cut out to be a real estate investor. And these are opposite sides of the same situation. For new people, it's pre-qualification. For people that are already working and doing transactions. It's a self-evaluation. And what I encourage people to do is not think in terms of being a real estate investor because anybody can be a real estate investor. There are no physical requirements for investing in real estate. But I do strongly believe in the five core abilities. And they are the first is the ability to pay attention. The second, the, you must be able to be curious. The third is you must ask strangers questions. The fourth, you must listen to what they say, not be thinking about what your answer is. The fifth, and the most important, the opposable thumb which separates all investors is that you must be able to determine how much risk you will take with your financial assets and how much of your personal time you will sacrifice to become successful. Real estate investing is not for everyone and not everyone should be an investor. Real estate involves risk. There is no way to eliminate risk in a real estate transaction. You may mitigate the risk by having partners or sharing the risk with others and have insurance. You can reduce the risk by due diligence work that you do, but you can never eliminate it. So you will have to sacrifice time and financial assets if you want to become successful in real estate. You can have more or less of the first four. Your curiosity is what creates the opportunity for creative deal structuring. You, and your curiosity leads directly to asking questions. The, the ability to listen to those answers. I know a lot of people who can talk to strangers, but they don't ever listen to what they have to say. But it always will get down to your decisions on what you will risk in time and money to become successful.